Welcome to my lecture online. Next, we're going to show that the hyperbolic cosine square of x is equal to the hyperbolic cosine of 2x plus 1, all divided by 2. So we're, again, we're going to work backwards. We're going to show that this is indeed equivalent to that, because that's easier to do. So we know that the hyperbolic cosine of 2x can be written as follows. This is equal to the hyperbolic cosine square of x plus the hyperbolic sine square of x. We showed that a few videos ago. We still have the plus 1 and then the whole thing divided by 2. Now we're going to take the 1 and rewrite that as follows. This can be written as the hyperbolic cosine square of x plus the hyperbolic sine square of x plus, and this can now be replaced by the hyperbolic cosine square of x minus the hyperbolic sine square of x. And the whole thing here is still divided by 2. And now we can see that we have one of these and one of these. When we add them together, we end up with 2 times the hyperbolic cosine square of x. But on the sine, hyperbolic sine square of x, here that's a plus, And this is a minus, so they cancel out. And we still have divided by 2. And then finally, when we simplify that, we end up with the hyperbolic cosine square of x, which means that what we have here on the right side must equal what's on the left side. And so therefore, that identity is true. That's how it's done.